Thank you, all praises to Yahweh Bashan, Shah Bashan, Kaka Bashan. We'll make this real quick. Lord willing, I'm going to title this video The Lease of the Flock Shall Draw Them Out. This is from Jeremiah 49, verse 20, and Jeremiah 50, verse 45. <clears throat> But I'll come back and I'll read them two verses and some other verses dealing with the word uh, desolate. Okay, this is from um, W I O N News. I'm gonna give you the, uh, what does it mean? I think it's World International something or other. Anyway, I'll get it in a minute, but um, okay. This wasn't the article or the video that I was looking for, but it's the same information. Okay, it says Israeli to hold massive military drill simulating an attack on Iran's nuclear sites. Now, I'm not gonna play this because you know how YouTube do, but she says, if you, if you listen to it, it, even 20 seconds in, it speaks about the military drills um, in the land of Israel, the Israeli mil military, but it, but she also said that the U.S. is working with them. The U.S. military is working side by side with the Israeli uh, armed forces. You know, we get we're close. Everything is all these prophecies. Habakkuk two, Habakkuk two, coming to pass in a big way. You know, anybody that uh, woke up to the fact that the Israelites and they're saying, I don't see anything. I don't, yeah, they don't see anything because the Most High is not dealing with you. The Most High hasn't opened your eyes. You're most likely not one of the elect. And we're supposed to, hey, the saying is strike, strike, the, strike while the iron is hot. Well, we're supposed to be, you know, if the spirit's on you to do a video, you, you, go, you go ahead and you do a video. You might do 10 videos a day. You might do long videos, an hour, hour long, two hours. Or you might do a little five, 10 minute, 20 minute video. This is more like a quick, a quick hit. Anyway, so I gotta watch the rest of this. Let me come back. Bear with me for a minute. Let me go to the home page. Okay, world is one news. That's what the W I O N stands for. World is one news. Bear with me for a minute. I'm trying to find an actual video. Hey, these people put up videos around the clock 28 minutes ago, 25 minutes ago, an hour ago, three hours ago. I'm just trying to find it. Let me do it this way. Yes.
Okay, this is the one that I opened up with Israel to hold mass, massive military drills simulating and attack on Iran's nuclear sites. Can't seem to find the other one. Let me try the word drill. I don't know why I can't find it. Unless they took it down. I know the video is about four minutes long. Here's one by new NATO mem members are not a threat. Uh, Turkey, Turkey is lone. Roadblock to Sweden, Finland, NATO bids. Tur Turkey is um, part of NATO. They're not with uh, Finland, Sweden being a part of uh, that union. Yeah, maybe they took this down. I don't know. They might have took it down. Anyway, it says here, Israel to hold massive military drills simulating an attack on Iran's nuclear sites. That's the least of them. That's at least the smallest among the Edomite nation. But I can't find the other one. Anyway, let me give you a couple of precepts. Jeremiah 49, verse 20. Therefore, here the council. Oh, when you read the, the really the whole chapter starting from the seventh verse on down. It speaks about the uh, judgment, the cup that will be given to uh, Esau, Edom. So this is just one step close to that. The fact that Israel, the Israeli forces and the US forces are working together. And they said this is the biggest uh, drill that they ever put together. I'm talking about the Israeli army and their focus is on Iran. Is it, and who backs up Iran? Gog and Magog. It said, therefore, hear the counsel of Yahweh that he have taken against Edom. So the Edomites, you know, vocab Malone says, well, the Edomites are done away with, but no proof, no receipts. This makes us, you know, a, a flat out statement. No, the Edomites are done away with. 
when you ask them when when, was it, when did the last of the might die where's the proof proof on it where's the receipts he has no receipts and his and his per, and and his purposes that he have purpose against the inhabitants of Timon. Surely, surely the least of the flock <clears throat> shall draw them out. Surely he shall make their habitation desolate with them. Whose habitation becoming desolate? Babylon the Great. It's going, it's going to be over some situation where the U.S. has to militarily back Israel because of, uh, and we got to watch and see. They, they, they're drilling right now. So when you drill and you, and you have a particular nation in your sights, that means you, you're planning to attack that nation militarily. Ezekiel chapter 38 speaks about Russia, the form of Gog and Magog, will be a God unto Iran and some of the other nations in that region. Libya is another one. Uh, Jeremiah 50 verse 45, therefore hear ye the counsel of Yahweh that he hath taken against Babylon. We know it's not talking about ancient Babylon. We, we know it's talking about the daughter of Babylon and his purposes that he have purpose against the land of the Chaldeans. Surely the least of the flock shall draw them out. Surely he shall make their habitation desolate with them. So I looked up the word desolate, and desolate comes up a bunch of times. Let me come back. One. Jeremiah Just in Jeremiah 50 alone it comes the word desolate comes up three times It says for out of the north there cometh up a nation against her which shall make her land desolate Because of the wrath of the Lord, it shall not be inhabited, but it shall be wholly desolate. Everyone that goeth by Babylon shall be astonished and hiss at all her plagues. Surely the least of them shall draw them out. Surely he shall make their habitation desolate. Twenty-six verse, and they shall not take of the a stone for a corner, nor a stone for foundation. In other words, when you build a house, a structure, you start with a foundation. So it starts with the first stone. Um, it, let me read that again. And they shall not take of the a stone for a corner, nor a stone for foundation. They're not going to build up again. But thou shalt be desolate forever, saith the Most High, saith the Lord, Yahweh. So I did a video on Lahab. He said that uh, a thousand years, from the time of the kingdom, a thousand years in the future, Esau is going to gather back together and come against us. Well, it says right here that they're going to be desolate forever. 
And after that thousand year period, we're going to burn them up, we're going to exterminate them. Sixty sixty second verse. Then shalt thou say, O Yahweh, thou hast spoken against this place to cut it off, that none shall remain in it. Talking about Babylon the Great, neither man nor beast, but but that it shall be desolate for what forever. Revelation 17, verse 16, and the ten horns which thou sawest upon the beast, these shall hate the whore. These are the EU and NATO nations. They're going to all come against the, uh, the Babylon, including Babylon's mother, Great Britain, or the UK. It says, and she, and, and shall make her desolate and naked and shall eat her flesh and burn and burn her with fire. Revelation 18 and 19. And they cast dust on their heads and cried weeping and wailing saying, alas, alas, that great city wherein were made rich. How did Chinese become rich? Through America, through exports. All that had ships in the sea by reason of a cost, costliness for one hour is she made desolate. Isaiah 13 destroyed the whole land. So come back to this one. There was another story. Just checking my notifications. Okay, there was another story of an Edomite in South Africa. Now, you so-called Africans, you have no power. You got Esau still in your land, you know, running shit. Let me see if I can find that article, uh, that video. Bear me for a minute. Yeah, this is an uproar right here. The uproar of the people. U.S. abortion rights fight. Fight gets bigger as Oklahoma. Oklahoma approves anti-abortion bill. Going to stare up the people, mainly these women. <clears throat> this society is definitely going down. There's another one. Tracking, <clears throat> tracking protests against food prices people take to the streets across the globe. I got to watch this later. <clears throat> and these uh, food prices and which we call infl um, hyperinflation. 
It's not just happening in America, it's happening all over the world. So the money, the, the, dollars, the dollar systems of the various nations, they're all connected to the US dollar, the Federal Reserve. The Federal, the Federal Reserve note. Russia intensifies attacks on Donbass. Zelensky says uh, Donbass completely destroyed. And Coach Red Pill did a video saying that um, uh, Zelensky's just sacrificing his own people. He'll be all right. He'll he'll after the, after this play after uh, the Ukraine is totally taken over. And a number of people, well, you have how many million, what, six to 10 million uh, refugees from uh, the Ukraine. And they're, make, they're making him up to be like a hero. He's, he's sacrificing his people. I can't believe I can't find this other one with the... Uh, let me do this. Let me try this. Student. Okay, I found it. Yeah, Esau is just gonna, he can't help from being the devil. Racist attack in South Africa. Oh, in the in South African University, it says student urinates. It, it should say white student urinates in black student's room. And if you go to it, there's an actual picture. Okay, that's that, that's an that's Edomite, and you can see him not showing the whole thing, but he's urinating on a so-called Black Africans. Uh, I guess his books is bed. This is they can't help it, man. They can't help from being the whole the whole world is waking up to this man. What does what does what does Habakkuk two say? Heck, Habakkuk 2 says a whole lot. Wow, look at that. Habakkuk 2. Let me go through this real quick. I will stand upon my watch, and that's us, and set me upon the tower, and will watch to see what he will say unto me, and what I shall answer when I am reproved. And what we do is we watch the news, we watch current events, and we filter filter them through the scriptures. That's why so many Christians are leaving Christianity among our people, and they're waking up to the fact that they're Israelites. Why? Because the way we go into the scriptures. And not just GMS. You know, Sakari, they go into uh, a lot of precepts, and they, and they uh, filter, you know, current events uh, through, through the scriptures. Um, same thing with uh, well, ISUPK. They go, they deal with a lot of current events too. You know, they all know that the Israelites. So, you know, I liken the mother camps to uh, Apollos. Uh, you can read about Apollos in Acts 18, chapter, where it said that the spirit was on him, but it was a uh, uh, Priscilla and Aquila that gave them a more perfect understanding because all he understood was uh, John the Baptist. The IUIC, you know, a lot of them, they filter. Now it's, you know what we're doing? We're filtering everything in within the scriptures. Everything is being filtered within the scriptures. Anything that you see on the news, 
this this drill, you have the Israeli forces and the U.S. forces. That it's called the drill is called war games. It's a practice in case they go to war, but the target is Iran. So if they're practicing on attacking Iran, that means they're going to actually do it. No different than a boxer. Boxer trains, he gets spawn partners. Now, if he's fighting the Southpaw, all, all of his spawn partners are going to be Southpaws. He's fighting a guy that's real tall, all his spawn partners are going to be tall. Second verse, and Yahweh answered me and said, write the vision and make it plain upon tables that he may run that readeth it. And what does it mean to make it plain upon tables? Meaning we, we give you the understanding of what this scripture means and what that scripture means. Now, Apostle Kabar did a video on the IUIC that one IUIC member said that, oh, this, this man talking about uh, Bishop Nathaniel, he broke down every book, every chapter in the book of Revelation. Well, guess what? When you check our videos, we, done did, we did that before he did that. And he used to charge too. You know, we broke down all the uh, prophetic scriptures and we didn't charge nobody. Uh, Bishop Nathaniel was charging people. And then when he realized we were messing up his money, he said, let me go ahead and break it down. When you check our, our hundreds and thousands of videos that we put up, we went through, we broke down Revelation 6, Revelation 5, Revelation 20, Revelation 21, Revelation 19, Revelation 18, Revelation 16. We, broke, we went through the whole book of Revelation. So what is this guy talking about? It says, for the vision is yet for an appointed time, but at the end it shall speak and not lie, though it tarry, wait for it, because it shall surely come and shall not tarry. We're in the time right now. No more tarry. We don't have to wait no more. You got the uh, monkey, monkey pox that's here in the United States. It's all over Europe, England, all different parts of Europe, Canada. There's a, a couple of clusters in Canada. And there's one case here in the States and that case is gonna turn into more cases. And then it may or may not be a, a epidemic or pandemic. Epidemic meaning over the people. Pandemic meaning all the people or most of the people. Oh, the avian flu is out of the news for some reason. Maybe they'll bring it back. It said, behold, his soul, which is lifted up, is not upright in him, but the just shall live by faith. <clears throat> so who are the just? <clears throat> They're not just Israel. <clears throat> They're the elect of Israel because the average Israelite, they don't have faith. So it's not talking about them. The just are uh, uh, referring to the uh, the, the, the elect of Israel and the elect of Israel for the most part are woken up, are sealed. Yet also because he is, because he transgressed by wine, his philosophy, his policy, he is a proud man, he keep it at home. Now I just gave you the article, showed you uh, the video with the so-called white man uh, urinating on uh, black African students, um, just bad books and so forth. It's just in 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 the in the in the, the black in the so-called black man's land. They can't help it. They can't help from being the devil. He is a proud man, neither keepeth at home, who enlarges his desire as hell and is as death. Hell meaning the grave. Death. That's why it's, it's, it's the next couple of words is and is as death. Hell meaning death. You put somebody in the grave. The Lord was in the in the heart of the earth, right? For three days and three nights. And they said it was hell. It was a prophecy made by uh, King David, the psalmist. He was talking about our Lord. The Lord wasn't burning in hell. He was in the grave for three days and three nights and rose back up. 
Lazarus was in the it was in hell for for four days. And is as death and cannot be satisfied, but gathers unto him all nations and heapeth unto him all people. That's in uh, First Maccabees, uh, chapter one, a uh, one world government. Or are you going to have uh, the world? What is it? The world financial, world economic forum. Next week. So keep your eyes on that. The World Economic Forum. You'll you'll hear from a uh, uh, Carl Schwab, and and you have to be a, a a billionaire to be invited. So none of us are invited, but you can watch them on uh, Financial News on YouTube and see what they say because they want to push that the the New World Order. They're getting ready to eat. Pursuant to uh, Job chapter 20. Shall not all these take up a proverb against them? The people are protesting. The scriptures speak of uproars of the other people, and they taunt in proverb against them and say, Woe to him that increaseth, increaseth that which is not his, meaning he stole everything he has, he stole. How long and to him that laideth himself with thick clay. Now the word, the Hebrew word for clay here is I bought yacht, which means depth. Shall they not <clears throat> rise up suddenly that shall bite thee and awake that shall vex thee and thou shalt be for booties unto them. Booties meaning spoils because thou hast spoiled many nations all the remnant of the people shall spoil thee. You have Jake talking about reparations. You have Jake talking about, you know, they, they, the discussion is about reparations and about, about slavery and the, the atrocities that, that these people committed against Jake. I was watching on 60 Minutes on YouTube, as Jake unknowingly purchased a house that was a plant that is that his his uh his four parents were slaves, and they showed in the back of the house it was a slave quarter, and that looked it was a shack. It was a shack, so you got you got to you got to deal with it, Esau. And he said he's gonna take that shack, and he's gonna he's gonna um you know, build it back up, restore it. Then they showed where his four parents were buried about a, maybe about a, I don't know, a half a mile up. And there were a bunch, and their, their tombstones were nothing but actual stones. Anytime there was a slave buried, they would bury them, then they would put a stone there. No name on it. So they, you know, they Esau back then treated treated Jake, you know, less than to them they were less than you you human. They were inhumane. And uh, payback is a bitch. He that leaves in the captivity, go go to the so go in the captivity. He that killed with the sword must be killed with the sword. If he be found in his hand, he shall what? If, if thou stealeth a man and sell him, or if he be found in his hand, he shall what? He shall be surely be put to death. They shall take them captives whose captives they were. Can't get around that. Because thou hast spoiled many nations, all the remnant of the people shall spoil thee because of men's blood and for the violence of the land, of the city, and of all that dwell therein, woe to him that covereth, uh, coveteth, covetous, and evil covetousness to his house, that he may set his nests on high, 
that he may be delivered from the power of evil because he's going to try to get out of here. The super, the only ones that's going to get all, on those so-called rockets are the super rich that can afford it. You can go to Amos 9. You can read the first two verses. Thou has consulted shame to thy house by, by cutting off many people and has sinned against thy soul. So not one Edomite is going to make it. They have sinned against uh, against uh, their, their soul. I'm going to read the last two verses and I'm going to close. Habakkuk 2, 15, 16. Woe unto him that giveth his neighbor drink. And that drink is a philosophy. Christianity. Democracy. That putteth thy bottle to him and maketh him drunken also. That thou mayest look on their nakedness. And nakedness means sin. Thou art filled with shame for glory. Drink thou also, and let thy foreskin be uncovered. The cup of the Lord's right hand shall be turned unto thee against Esau, and shameful spewing shall be on thy glory. Your glory is what? What you build up. Anyway, with that, I'm going to say Shalom.